My name is Linda Kay. I am married to Sean. We have two beautiful children, Charles and Katie. And we have two dogs, Addie, who is very, very sweet, and Buddy, who is very, very crazy. Buddy, Buddy, come here. So tell me a bit more about him. Where is he from? How old is he? He was one in July, July the right. 1st. We got Buddy at a rescue, and we adopted him. I think he was 10 weeks, around 10 weeks old when we got him. Although he was young, I believe, when they found him at the flea market, I think they were only five weeks old and not with their mother. Buddy, buddy, right, get down. Get down. Well, he's waiting for the television to come on. He's yeah. waiting for the television. He likes to watch to TV. On. One of our biggest issues is we are, we are really unable to watch animal shows as a family. He goes crazy. Can I see that? Certainly. Every time we have Victoria's show on, Buddy goes crazy. I'm concerned a little bit about his response to Victoria because so far the previews aren't that good. Turn the TV on for you. Okay. Buddy, buddy. Buddy, no. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. I hear myself think. That is such a high pitch bop. No, 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 can stop it. No, so our, our we just turn solution, Victoria, is to turn the television off. And then I think who's winning? <laughs> Buddy has had a full year of aggressing at the television. So there's a real habit there. And I knew it was going to take a while to break that habit. What we're going to do is a removal technique. Each time he goes for the television, I'm going to go, uh oh and walk him out. Give him a timeout for about a minute. Okay. Then bring him back in again. If he has a bad reaction, we're gonna go back to timeout. If he does stay in here and he doesn't have a reaction, he's gonna get some nice food. Okay. So I'm going to be rewarding the calm behavior and removing him for the crazy behavior. It sounds like a great idea. I just don't know that this is gonna work. I put this on him because I don't wanna pick him up. Um, I don't want to have to, to drag him by his collar. So I want you to turn the television on, and I'm going to start holding the leash, and we'll see what happens. As soon as the television was turned on, Buddy reacted. One bark came out of his mouth, and he was out in timeout, which in this case was the bathroom. We wait for a minute. The secret of this is that if he really starts barking, we ignore it, and you only bring him out when there has been at least three seconds of quiet. Boy. Up. It was very hard for me to watch the training. When he had to be kind of drugged back into the timeout, I know that that was very stressful for him. Up. 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 It takes over 25 minutes and countless trips to the bathroom before finally. Good. Buddy has a breakthrough. It's important not to give him the reinforcer right here so that he's looking at it. At the same time? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I mean, I know I want him to look at the dog and look away. That's right. the whole point of it. Look away from the And at the, the moment, you say quiet. Yeah. With that. Yeah. Okay. If he could look at the television, see an animal, and then look back at me and be calm, he got the jackpot reward, which was a toy stuffed full of peanut butter. Quiet. Good. Okay, now you can turn it off. It was fantastic watching Buddy sitting on the sofa with Victoria, and dogs were present on the television, yet he would still look away at her for the treat. It was just remarkable. Buddy gets a chance to work on the TV training. Quiet. Good. good. Tell him good. Give it to him. Good. Nope. nope. Quiet. Come here, Addy. You know what, Linda Kay? We might need a different treat for him. I think he doesn't like peanut butter anymore. OK, we'll send him up Quiet. there. I don't think this is going to do it for him. It's no wonder Buddy's not even interested in that treat, because he's full from all that turkey. Good. 
quiet. For whatever reason, Buddy is absolutely not getting it to um, to be quiet. He's just, it's not registering with him. I'm just really frustrated and I'm wondering if this is even ever gonna be a reality for us to watch TV together. There's got to be another way. I mean, I just, I don't see this working. Forget it. I can't, let's just, I can't do it anymore. Come on, one more. No more, no more. Can't do it. Vindicate, don't get discouraged. You've been so dedicated up to this point. Don't worry, I have a solution and I'm on my way back. All right, now the television. I knew that was gonna be hard. Victoria, I just don't feel like we've made one ounce of progress. I mean, I'm frustrated and I think, is I don't know, is this gonna work, this tactic? Normally when you do this training, you'll see that it's not 20 times when we do it again. It goes down to 15, and then okay. it goes down. So you do see a gradual lessening of it. Now, if that's not happening, then you have, then we have to rethink. So I want to revisit that. Okay. Let's get to it, okay? All right. I think we need to go back to basics. I want to put on, on the screen, a paused picture of a dog. And I'm just going to see what he does. I'm not going to take him out if he barks. I'm not going to reward him if he stops. I just want to see what he does. As soon as he saw a dog on the television, he went crazy. Using a toy, Victoria attempts to grab Buddy's focus, but to no avail. Buddy seems to be incredibly resistant to the timeout method. So I'm gonna have to come up with something better. I have a plan to flip this method. So instead of removing Buddy, I'm going to remove Sean and Linda Kay. I'd like us to get up and just walk, just a little further away, just walk. After a time of leaping up at the television, Buddy looked around to see that we weren't there. So he wondered where we'd gone and he followed us. And then he stood with us in the hallway as if to say, what's going on? No one's watching me. We're just ignoring him, OK? OK. When he's quiet, we go back into the room. <laughs> I waited for three seconds of quiet, and then we walked back into the sitting room again. As soon as we walked back in again, Buddy went for the television again. When he went for the television, we walked out again. He saw that we walked out, he followed us. Quiet, good. <laughs> We did this a number of times and he kept looking at us saying, what are you doing? Quiet. Walk back in very calmly. Mm -hmm. By the time we had done this technique a few times, I knew that we were getting to him. Good, now did you see that? I just saw he wanted to go and he stopped himself. Good boy. Now remember, this is a dog really having to employ impulse control. I'm giving him an incentive, and I'm also working him in the presence. So... He just looked. Watch. Good boy. Good boy. It seems like he wants to be with us, and us removing ourselves from the room has proven to be a, a good technique. I would like you to do a week of okay. just still pictures on your television of animals. OK. And then after that, when he doesn't really care that they're there at all, I want you to start moving those pictures. But again, it's the same thing every day for a week. It's the same pr program. This is progress. Yeah. This is a miracle. It was a really great ending to this training because at the beginning, I think Linda Kay and Sean were both really demoralized. They didn't like the timeout process. It was really hard and Buddy wasn't getting it. But now, have, removing themselves from the room, that was it. That was the point where Buddy started to change, and it couldn't have ended better. The TV time is definitely a work in progress, and we are all committed to continuing with this training, no matter how long it takes. Good. Good.